Hey, what's happening gamers? Welcome back to Disney Infinity 2.0 and it's time for us to dive into the Guardians of the Galaxy playset. You requested it and it's gonna happen. We're gonna do some toy box stuff uh, after we finish the Guardians of the Galaxy. So it's time for us to dive into what Star Wars should have been, according to my wife. Yeah! <laughs> yeah. This is what I was waiting for, but never happened. New game! This is the Milano hailing the space station nowhere. Cosmo, buddy, you there? I repeat. Ronin's necrocraft are gaining on us. What's our next move? <laughs> that question implies there was some sort of plan to begin with. Wait. You stole an Infinity Stone. One of the most powerful objects in the universe. The Ronin the Accuser. One of the most vile despots in the universe. But you have no exit strategy. Oh, I am Groot. Guys, guys, <laughs> I've totally got a plan. I'll tell you in a sec. Ah, Groot's disappointment. On. I am Groot. I am Groot. We can't take many more hits like that. <sighs> what is the problem this time, Star Lord? Cosmo, my pal! We're coming in hot with a couple of bogeys on our back. I see no bogeys, but there are several necrocraft on your tail. And thanks, by the way, for leading Ronan's lackeys here. Yeah, about that. Ronan might want the thing we're bringing to the Collector. Sometimes I think it's you who we need shielding from. Lower the shields already! I can lower the shields for a moment. Dog quickly. I cannot allow these necrocraft to overrun nowhere. That should pose no problem. We just lost our speed downers. See? My plan worked. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's funny. Oh, their ship has seen better days. Ouch. That was a cool opening scene. I like that. Star Lord. <laughs> he doesn't say anything cool at the beginning. Some necrocraft made it through our shields. I suggest you make your delivery quickly. The okay. Russian speaking dog. Okay. Cosmo. Oh, okay. Uh, hopefully everybody got out. Oops. I'm not making any more stops. <laughs> yeah, this is the kind of... Uh, when I saw the movie, I was like, this is what I wanted for episode one, two, and three. Something like this. A ragtag group, you know, of, of people that are all kind of like... They don't know each other very well, and they have to like work together, and like that was what epi that was what the like, the original Star Wars was, and like then Episode One, Two, and Three got so like just boring, and then this 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 was a great sci-fi movie. I really liked it. It was a Whoa. lot of fun. That's what it was supposed to be, you know, fun. Uh, that's what you I want to know what I'm having fun with? What parkour? Parkour. Parkour. Space bike parkour. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wow, we did a number on poor Cosmo's little base. <laughs> Aww. Way to go, Star-Lord. Nice rocket boots. Pretty cool. I want rocket boots now. It's too bad he has to wear that weird... Th he hardly ever wears that in the movie. Well, let's see. That He's kind of face. in the vacuum of space. Yeah, I know. I mean, that would be something, you know. Yeah, it makes sense. You're looking for the collector, no? He ought to be around here somewhere. I am pressing. Oh, you smash the wall with your yeah, fist? Wow. Indicates the direction and distance to your next mission objective. Radar will show you what's around you. Yellow dots mark the location of your mission objectives. You can also use your radar to locate mission givers, enemies, and items of interest. Why do you gotta do tutorials in every playset? Uh. But, uh, needless to say, I have not read any Guardians of the Galaxy comics, so I don't really know what it's like in the comics at all, so. Well, yep. there's Star-Lord in it, and yeah. he's had lots of girlfriends. Yeah, that's the only thing I didn't like about it very much. Psh. He's a space player. He is. <laughs> player in space! He's like, he's like Han Solo, kind of, except for a little worse than that. <laughs> so if he doesn't have a cool ship like the Millennium Yeah, Falcon. exactly. He just steals ships all the time. Well, actually, no, technically they do have a ship, but I forget the name of it. Me too. What I didn't under- Oh! Iron Man coins! Crossover character to enter this playset and unlock exclusive missions. Ooh! Iron Man can play in this. Of course Iron Man can play in this, because it's Iron Man. Iron Man. I am a human man. Tony Stark wants to work out a deal within this universe to uh, 
be part of every single playset. I would just pay them money. If he he needs to be part of the Disney Originals playset too, they need to have crossover. Oh my god. Although I would do I would do Iron Man and Spider Man for crossover characters. <laughs> ah, welcome, collector. Here, take it already. Oh, 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 this is an Infinity Stone. Yeah, no big deal. This explains the Necrocraft. I'm guessing Ronan is not happy with you. Understatement. Oh, I'm more than happy to relieve your burden. I'll find a safe place in my collection for this beauty. Guardians, I need your help. Thanks to your little stunt, nowhere is under full-fledged attack. I am Groot? Yeah, if those Sakarans overrun nowhere, it's Sayonara Infinity Stone. Let's do this, Rocket Dude, Raccoon. I'm the spaceman. Nice. I'm back from out of space. The collector is now available in my toy box. Oh my gosh, the collector guy is so creepy. They dumb him down a little bit for this kid's playset, but. Uh. He's the collector. Yeah, he's. Oh, he's so a Nova's creepy the guy. other play coin. That's what I'm talking about. No, it's not what you're talking about. Not not cool. Yeah, he collects, like, uh, people and different, uh, animals and different creatures from space. I know what he does. He's yeah. a collector. Yeah, and he makes them work for him sometimes. Oh, just so everybody knows, too, we got all of our discs. All of our Disney Infinity yeah. 2.0 discs. So we got the symbiote Spider-Man, Red Hulk, and all the different fun stuff that we will be making additional videos for, either together or separately, uh, very soon. Yep. So, just because there's so many games that we're looking at. Yeah. And, Divide and conquer. Yeah, if you guys are uh, here to subscribe for uh, Galaxy Guardian people, Guardians of the Galaxy, uh, we're also doing Hyrule Warriors and all kinds of stuff, so mm -hmm. check out our channel. Yay! Your little stunt is making Nova a prime target for Sakaran attack. I'm locking down all doors until the space station is safe. Sakaran troops are deploying drop pods on the docking platform. Destroy them before they find and deactivate the shield. I can do that. Luke is truly the kitten whisperer. Our cat was just over there scratching something and he just put his I, little hand I didn't, up. I didn't even need to do anything. It's like, <laughs> cats, come. He just looked at our kitten and she just came right to him. Yeah, because she knew she was doing something bad. Mm -hmm. Just destroying the grocery bag. This is such a cool playset. I know, isn't it? Isn't this what Star Wars should have been like? Oh my god. Why? Stop bringing up Star Wars. Okay, I don't I'm want... not going to talk about it anymore. No, don't. Don't. Like for Amber not talking about I Star won't. Wars anymore. I'm not going to talk about it anymore. Now that feels good. That does feel good. Pineapple woman. I'm not talking about it. Oh. Well. I just... So, in case anyone doesn't hasn't seen the movie or read the comics or whatever... Um, Groot, once, once we put him on here, you know, he's- the only thing he can say is, I am Groot. Why were you- why are you bringing just, up Groot I'm when I'm saying, playing a Star-Lord? I know, I'm just saying. There's so many cool things you can say about Star-Lord, right, like, know. he's Fine, stuck in the 80s. Fine, why don't you talk about Star-Lord, then? Perhaps he's stuck in the 80s. He is- he is stuck in the 80s, he's got a Walkman, he's got a mixtape, he's got mm -hmm. several mixtapes. Yep. And all his catchphrases are from the 80s. Yep, He's amazing. Um, he kind of got taken when he was a little boy into space and... In, from the 80s. And he had a little, um, mixtape with him that his mom gave him. I'm amazed that cassettes would still work in space, honestly. I know. I'm amazed it didn't run out of batteries or something. I don't know how it Maybe it uses it. space batteries. Yeah, uh -oh. that's what I'm thinking. Maybe he found an alternate fuel source. Aha! This is a really cool-looking playset. Yeah, I like it. I am so into this. I could totally, because of the Guardians of the Galaxy, I'm going to say this once, because of this playset, they could do Star Wars. Yes. They have troops inside. The quicker you destroy them, the less damage they'll do. Okay. You know who I wish I could put in this playset? Buzz Lightyear would be Oh awesome. my gosh, yes. That would be so cool. Well, what you can do is you can make a toy box version of Guardians of the Galaxy and have Buzz Lightyear oh, in there. Oh, I would totally do that. Yes, see. That'd be fun. I am Iron Man, coin. Yeah. This is fun. I yeah, like this. I knew you would have fun on this one. I have fun on this one! Yay! 
Yeah, going down, we son. We are fun. We are fun. <laughs> are you fun? I am Groot. <laughs> I am Groot, yes. Let's do this! Is there like a counter of how many of these bad guys I'm supposed to do? Noticed it takes a few moments for drop pod to open and spawn enemies. You could use this to your advantage, no? Who's who's dropping enemies where? I don't even see where the enemies are coming from. I'm just punching know. them. Did you? I think you questioned me. Look at that, I just won. I did something cool. That drop that left some residual damage. Clear the obstructions that block the exit from the launch area. Uh, what he said. Obstacles and clear a path to the rest of the space station. That is, unless you want to remain sitting ducks. <laughs> I like ducks. You've received a new mission. What? All of your active missions will be tracked in your mission log. Check your mission log at any time to view your current missions, or activate your mission guide. Stop with the tutorials, dude. Thank you, Ben Ten. Yeah, Ben Ten. You could totally play as Ben 10 in this environment, too. Oh, I would so love that. But wait, is Ben 10 of Disney property? No! Okay. No, come on, no. I just thought everyone was bought by Disney at this point. Never. In the, in the future, in the year like 2040 or something, every single thing will be owned by Disney. <laughs> They'll have a world... I don't, I don't believe it. <laughs> It'll be a one-world uh, government, and it'll be Disney. <laughs> I don't know. See, I told you they were called repulsor rays. Okay. Because that's what Iron Man said. He said, charging repulsor rays. No, I want to hear some cool, like, you know, what? Uh, like oldies music in the background. I know, right? Well, because actually, his, no. Uh, they, tape deck. I know. Well, his oh, tape deck. Oh, it's probably all copyright stuff. It's all copyright. Oh, boom! Nice. Boom. I just cleared that! I'll let you detonate fuel cells in the launch area to clear a path. But only this time. Drop them or throw them. Then this is a nice looking playset. This is an amazing playset. I love this playset. I highly recommend you guys and gals get it. If you can. The fuel cells. Use them against the Sakaran ship. It's yes, the I'm, I'm gonna use them against the Sakaran ship. Jerk. Eat fuel cell! Yeah! yeah. Good job! When do Never I... gonna give you up, <laughs> never gonna let you down, never gonna run around and hurt you, just gonna throw fuel cells and watch them explode. Boom. Wow. I just sang a song from that one dude. Do, 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 do. Yeah. There you go, there's your mixtape. <laughs> that was amazing, I needed that, thank you. Never gonna give, never gonna give, give you up. <laughs> you just got K-wing rolled. Uh, so what? <laughs> like that was hard or something. Yeah, I know, right? Woohoo! Does he say like that was hard or something? I know, cause he's Star Lord. So, uh, I love Star Lord. I want to be him for Christmas. Are you Halloween? For a real challenge? No. Oh, you can do verses. Verses. You know what I like about this movie what? the most? Well, it's it's very feel good at the end, but you know I I, I think it has good messages in it, guys. except for Star Lord being a player. But other than that, he I I really what? like the love story in it because it kind of is like how true love really is, where love is a decision. You know, mm. he finally kind of like. It, well, I'll have to see how the next movie goes, but it looks like he's gonna give up his player like ways and actually. You know, make a decision to be, be with the green skin mm -hmm. chick. Yeah. Yep. Yep. Until he goes to the Avatar planet when he finds a blue no. blue skin chick. He made a decision. He loves her. Let's hope the actress comes back so he can continue to love her. <laughs> Either that or they could recast her, pull a Rachel Dawes. No. Oh. I would feel so bad if they did that. Well, all, bay. all the characters in this well when I was watching the movie they all kind of like grow on you at first I didn't like any of them and then I was like okay now they're they grow on you as I am it. Groot yeah I except am for Groot. Groot he's cool right at the beginning I am Groot I am Groot I am Groot yeah so the way he says it is yeah different the way he says I am Groot shows what he's saying so I am Groot it's kind of like a cat says Okay, that's just weird. 
<laughs> it's the same. Where art thou, mission givers? He's like, he's like a kitty. <laughs> Scratching post. <laughs> exactly. Starfire's perfect matches. A scratching post. <laughs> Regardless of the raging battle, I have Creepy important man. business matters to attend to. Install new fuel cells in my delivery alert systems, and I'll be in your debt. Cool. Let's do what he said. Okay. Power fuel. So I need to grab some fuel cells, which are these. Boom. All right. And take them that way. But to be clear, I wasn't saying this is what I thought Star Wars four, five, and six should be. I was saying this is what I thought the they yeah, get it. One, two, and three should have been. Okay, I'm done. Oh, that's all I really need. These missions are really easy. That's that's all I need to do. Huh? Okay. Nice. And throw it in. Where's everyone oh. who's supposed to be shooting at you again? Uh, oh, you beat them a, up. They're on a soda break. They're like, yeah, we'll get to them. Wait, what? Why didn't Why didn't that work? Oh, I see. I got to be faster than the average space guy. Go, spaceman. Well, I hope they have a lot of content for this. I'm uh, sure they will. This because there's they obviously did a great job on the environment design. Peter Quill rules. When he has two guns, yet I can only use one. Oh, that's right, because we need to go into the thing. The skill tree. Let's I see might, what we can do for Quill. Yeah, if I actually could use these kind of blocks to make my own uh, toy box, I might actually have fun making toy boxes now. You should make, like, toy boxes on live streams. I should. I think that'd be... That way you won't fun. be, like, bored out of your mind. <laughs> yeah. Uh, what is this? Ooh. Special move bonus. Or I could yes. just make them to my mixtape. I want a mixtape now. <laughs> okay, so let's give them increased you, health. You always have mixtapes, gaming. I gave you a mixtape. That's what love is. <laughs> love is mixtapes. Okay. Shots fired for mixtapes. True love involves mixtapes. Remember that, kids. And grandparents. <laughs> if, you know, whatevs. Push boy. May I have your assistance, please? Why? Which way? Where? Where is this assistance? Where's the talking dog? I still can't fly. Makes me sad. Doo -doo -doo. It's very sad. I would like to take away that scary ship, but it's kind of freaking me out a little yeah, bit. It's looming over here like it could like start shooting at us any second. This playset is so fantastic. It is. Oh my gosh. Love it. Oh, let's kill that thing. Oh, can't kill the alien. Oh, too bad. There is Cosmo. Cosmo is a dog. While you were busy destroying the launch area, Sakarons found their way into invade nowhere's living quarters. It's an invasion. Invasion sucks. the living quarters and stop Sakarons from harassing inhabitants. Here. I'll unlock the access gate. Okay. Okay. Just the access. Yep. Access granted. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, nice. This is beautiful. Not so much about the Sakarans, though. They're they're not the pretty, but look at this. It's like a mini city. It is. I wonder how much of this you actually get to explore in free mode, though. This might be the biggest playset yet. That would be so. Cool. That would be amazing. I'd be so happy. That would be stellar. Interstellar. Because <laughs> of space and jumps. Yeah, because stop it's it's in space. Yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna stop the Karns by shooting them. So K Wing, when am I gonna play next episode or are you gonna yes. have me jump in? Oh okay. Yes. Next episode, you guys will get to see Next episode. You'll have to subscribe the, to see Amber play. The green lady, which I can't remember her name. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. Don't say sorry to me. I mean, at least I know I'm you. I'm sorry to everybody. Wait, who, what's your name again? Hey. I'm sorry. My old age, uh, you know. Ooh. Nowhere is under attack. Yeah, I know. Whatever. I don't care. Nowhere is under attack. You gotta look out for number one, Star Lord. You don't really. Wait, care Wait, this about thing can't fly. Else. What? What? Why can't a space vehicle fly? That's lame. Weird. I expect for my space vehicles flight. Well, maybe it's one of the vehicles that's just in the town. 
Oh. You're kind of in a city right now. That yeah, has lasers on the rooftops. I want to live here. Let's <laughs> retire here. No! I don't think so. My kind of town. I think this is like a town full of like ruffians and scoundrels. Oh, a, that's that's what my super move is? I throw a like a mini turret? Am I? Yeah. So Han Solo would live here. No, I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> I don't even know if Han Solo is going to be in the new movie because uh, Harrison Ford got hurt when they were filming it. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. No. He's old. I feel sad. Harrison Ford can't be as amazing and awesome as he used to be. I mean, he, they, they, could, they could probably CG in Harrison Ford now. Yeah. Just have totally. him do the voice. Nobody would be able to tell because it'd be like, "Wow, Harrison Ford even makes CG look good." <laughs> exactly. Uh oh, here comes trouble. Watch out for these guys and their I small got knives. I, I don't need to worry about small knives when I can do this thing. Okay, so how I'm supposed to defeat the Sakarans in this mode is I'm supposed to destroy those little generator thingies. Stop Sakarans, however you can. Just be sure this does not include destroying nowhere. You're nowhere. I like the dog's voice. It's cute. I like it. I want a dog with a Russian accent. Actually, our cat is Russian. Yep. That's how she talks to me sometimes. Yeah. In my Remember mind. what the doctor said about that <laughs> stuff, hon. Oh, right. I'm not supposed to tell that to anyone else. Hello, doctor. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna get a gonna get a call. What's that, Tink? Wow, I love your your Russian accent, Tink. No, okay, uh, I'm done. <laughs> you know it. Nova's like, yeah. Man, this is fun. Totally. Oh yeah, Star Lord. Gives me. And the Galaxy Rangers. Galaxy Rangers was that show. Oh, okay, cool. But it wasn't Star Lord. But there was a, a thing called Star Lord, I think, cool. or Star Sheriff. I don't remember. It was so long ago. I do not remember these things. Uh, plain. There may be a surprise when you least expect it. Surprise! Yeah, like the surprise is called Star Lord. I'm here. Exactly. Boo! Yeah. Right behind you. All right, the rocket boots are a nice touch, but you know, you know what this character kind of reminds me of. Oh my gosh, what? I just thought of a character that could so be in Disney Infinity and needs to. What? The Rocketeer. <gasps> oh, yes. yeah, that would be Disney amazing. classics, The Rocketeer, make it happen. It was a Disney movie, I forgot. It was a Disney movie. It was a great Disney movie. That would be great. Had love in it and a bad guy and, you know, Different action. environments yeah. that you could go to, like... Perfect. The airfield, and yep. then you could go to the... There you go. Yeah. Make it happen, Disney. That's that's the place you that I want. You could go to that place that had jazz singing and stuff like that, and there was called Jazz Club. Jazz Club singing jazz And then music. you could have a blimp level where you're fighting on top uh, of the blimp. That would be great. Oh, okay. So these little platforms is how I make it to where I'm supposed to go. Just be sure this does not include destroying nowhere. Haha, <laughs> I made you nice. guys just be destroyed for my awesomeness. Are you up for a real challenge? No. <laughs> You're stupid. Well, anyway, gamers, that's going to conclude this episode Yay. of Guardians of the Galaxy and our look at Star-Lord. Uh, join us next time as Peter Quill is joined by Amber's green skin character yeah. and we play some... Co-op. Thanks so much for taking the time to watch. Don't forget to like this video if you enjoy Guardians of the Galaxy. And we'll see you in a bit with the second interstellar galactic goodness episode <laughs> of Galaxy Guardian Rangers people. Yeah. See you, Bye. In, see you in a bit.